Pittsburgh mystery 60 years in the making. Sunday marks six decades since a B-25 Mitchell bomber crashed into the Mon River. So how could a World War II era plane with a wingspan of 67 feet just simply vanish? Around 4 p.m. on January 31, 1956, the plane ran out of gas. The pilot landed in the freezing river. Four people survived, two died, and the aircraft sank. You know, when you're looking for the Titanic, you have a vast ocean. But when you're looking in the Mon, you have trees and you have um, shopping carts and, and billboards and cars. The next morning, the plane was gone. The crew wasn't talking, and conspiracy theories abounded. Was it carrying a bomb, a secret cargo? Did the government remove it in the dead of night? No one can really say for sure, Wendy. Yeah, we know some experts think the ghost bomber, though, is still out there somewhere in the Mon. They're going to try to find it.